I told a pastor, I said, listen, if people give in church, it's not because they fear the pastor, it's because they honor God. If you call me sir, it's not because you are not older than me. It's not because you are no more powerful than me. It's your reverence for God that is now manifested in your reverence for the one whom God has sent. Say, blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord. And what did they do? They put palm fronts and their clothes on the ground. Yeshua never forced them to do it. But their honor for God translated into honor for... So if your members are not giving, it's because maybe either they are not taught about giving or they do not honor God. Simple as short. Do you know you can raise a congregation that honors solution more than God? So they give to manifestations and not God. If there's a heavy manifestation here, you say, hey, let me wave this on your head. Bring 5,000. They will come. Jesus Christ. They will come. Listen. But I can come here and preach the word of God and someone say, ah, you bless me. Please, let me honor you with this. That's how it was. That's how real giving ministry is honor for God. If I honor a man because he came in the name of the Lord and I gave him cold water, I will receive the blessings of the Lord that he came with. It's as simple as that. You see, I've, I have been to some of our members' office and powerful people, and this part older than me. You see police everywhere. Yeah, yeah, no, sir, sir. We went to a program one time, me and my, some of my brethren, and when they brought rice and chicken and everything for us, it just dawned on me. I said, wait, I'm a stranger here. These people don't know me from anywhere. What is making them put me in this nice hotel? And then they are bringing all these things for me to eat. And me and my brethren. And I told them, I said, as you eat this food, eat with reverence because it is because of the Lord this food is given to us. I told them, if not because of the Lord's honor, how would it, you do? <laughs> it's strange. Do you think it's easy to transfer money to church? <laughs> you don't understand. You have family members. You, some people have given to church what they've not given any of their family members. See, sir, the punishment of sons of God will be great too if we fail God. It's terrible. You see. So, deception loves places of authority. 